Losing his job, falling into financial trouble, and getting divorced, Terry Wadsworth was at a low point. But instead of feeling sorry for himself, he decided it was a good time to help others. It was a good decision, too, inspired by a sermon that he heard at 12 Stone Church in Gwinnett County about random acts of kindness. Terry started small, but now his random acts have inspired others all over the country. Hey, Steve Watt. I'm here hey, with Sherilyn. Hey, Sherilyn. <laughs> what started as a normal trip to Walmart for Terry Wadsworth two years ago turned into a whole lot more than just a grocery run. I looked over to the layaway counter and I saw people lined up with, with just buggies and stuff. And, you know, kids want to, they want to take it home. And they're upset because they can't take it home. And that inspired a random act of kindness. She's helped me pick a layaway ticket out for some some unsuspecting person, and I'm going to pay that layaway ticket off. And what are we getting today? What are we buying? We are buying a baby doll, a mobile pup, and a pink truck. Wadsworth decided to share this video on Facebook, but he never expected what would happen next. It went crazy. Within 12 or 14 days, we had gone, the video had gone to a little over 3,000 shares. It had gone to 13 different states. And we had paid off, uh, we had paid off uh, 300 layaways. And this year, TWOD's layaway challenge is even bigger and better. Today I'm started off, I paid the, my first Chris Layway today, which included a giant Barbie house and some other toys for some young lady here in the Gwinnett County area. In the last two years we've probably gone to 18, 19 states, 50 or 60, probably different kinds of uh, contribution, and there's, there's probably 50, 60 thousand dollars of, of layaways and, and, and good deeds done for folks. And while the donations are anonymous and he doesn't get to see the recipient's reactions, he gets a lot of joy just imagining what this surprise must feel like to a family at Christmas. At the, at the end of the day, it's got to be really cool when you're like, I need to buy groceries or I need to go get their Christmas. What are you going to do? You know, what are you going to do? So when you all of a sudden don't have to make that choice, it's got to be cool. It's got to be good. It's got to be a great fit. It's got to be a great Christmas. Terry's goal is for this to go way beyond just paying layaways at Christmas time, and it already has with people anonymously paying off delinquent lunch accounts at schools, buying Christmas trees, and more random acts of kindness. And you can check out his Facebook page, TWADS Layaway Challenge 2017, to share your stories or to read about what others are doing this holiday season. The cool thing is it's an individual act. Mm -hmm. It's not a 501c3 big charity organization. And, and interestingly, when he started, he was down on his luck. You know, he's gotten back on his feet now, but he didn't have any money. And he said, you know what? I'm going to I'm going to hold 10 doors for 10 people today for no reason. He went to the wow. store just to hold doors for people, just to find a way to kind of, you know, encourage people and brighten their that day. That is so cool. I mean, even the smallest thing can make yeah. a big difference. So especially paying off someone's low. That's oh, a big no. thing. Can you imagine that makes how a big that must difference. feel when you go and you're like, oh, I got to pay it. Wow. Oh, I love that. Merry Bring Christmas. joy. Yeah. Merry Christmas. Yeah. Christmas to a lot of people.